Okay, welcome everybody to the Getting to Know You uh, Get Tutorial video series. Um, so this is just an idea that uh, I came up with because there was a bunch of people who were saying that they've never seen Git explained properly and maybe me being my cocky self, I think that maybe I could do it. I don't know. Who knows? Um, now, I don't profess to be a Git expert in, by any means. I've only been using it for a little while. Um, but this knowledge and these techniques have kind of gotten me through using Git and they seem to be pretty successful. So hopefully they'll benefit you too. Now, so that being said, any of the Git experts out there who watch these videos, uh, or you have any corrections, please, I welcome that feedback. Uh, just post some comments on the YouTube videos um, and I'll try to incorporate those corrections into the video. So that, that would be very helpful. Um, so just to know, just to kind of get you started, um, you don't really need any source control experience per se. You, you don't have to have used uh, previous source control systems like SVN or CVS or anything like that. Um, but higher level understanding of source control, like checking in code, checking out code, that might help you along. And if you happen to have used previous source control systems, uh, they'll probably aid you in certain ways. And in other ways, they actually might hurt you because Git is a little bit different in terms of how you think uh, in terms of source control. Um, so to watch these videos, the best thing to kind of do is kind of watch them in order because uh, the examples kind of build on themselves and they kind of lead you through a logical way to, to learn Git. Um, and the other thing is, uh, but they're split up so you can go back and watch any given video if you kind of forget something, you know, and just want a quick reference. I didn't want to make them too long. I didn't want to make an hour long Git video where you have to sit through the whole thing, right? So just kind of in pieces. Um, another thing I want to say is that I am using uh, Mac OS uh, X, so, or OS X. Um, so if you guys are Windows users out there, um, you might want to download something called Git Bash, uh, spelled like this. Uh, git bash or any kind of bash uh, shell. So for those who don't know what uh, bash is, it's think of it like in Windows you have a command prompt, right, where you can do CD and DIR. You can kind of browse through things. Bash is another type of shell with different commands, right? Uh, these Linux commands. So that's another thing you might want to know is just some basic Linux commands like ls, pwd. You can do a quick Google search to kind of get you through that, and that that'll help you following along with the uh, tutorials. Um, all right, and the last thing I'll say basically is that as you can see, these videos aren't very professionally done. As you can see, I'm just using a Word document to show my title. Um, if there's a lot of interest generated, maybe I'll put some more production value into these, but I wanted to get something out really quick and something that wouldn't take too much of my time to record. So uh, if you guys want something more professional, uh, please let me know. Just post some comments and that would be great. So I think that's it for my lengthy introduction. Uh, we'll just get started right with the next video. So enjoy and hopefully you guys learn something about Git and how wonderful a piece of uh, uh, software it can be, so.